Have you ever been deep into coding only to be stopped in your tracks by an unexpected error? It can be incredibly frustrating, right? If you've encountered a type error in TensorFlow, you're in the right place. Today, we're gonna unravel the mystery behind the error message. List of tensors when single tensor expected. I totally get it. You're working hard on your TensorFlow project and suddenly an error pops up, leaving you scratching your head. You're not alone in this. Many developers face similar issues when working with TensorFlow. Let's dive into the specific question at hand. One user recently asked, why am I getting a type error when using TF constant with TF random normal? They provided this code snippet, tf.constant tf.randomnormal time step batch size night is one one. Sound familiar? If so, let's break it down together. So what's going wrong here? The error message indicates that TensorFlow is expecting a single tensor, but it's receiving a list of tensors instead. This often happens when the input shapes or types are mismatched. Let's explore this further and stick around. By the end of this video, you'll not only understand the error, but also learn how to fix it and avoid similar issues in the future. To address the type error, the user should first understand that the issue arises from the use of the tf.randomnormal function. This function returns a tensor, but it seems the user is trying to pass it directly into tf.constant, which expects a single tensor, not a list of tensors. Next, the user should ensure that the parameters passed to tf.randomnormal are correct. The first parameter should be a shape tuple, which in this case is time step batch size. This should be fine, but let's confirm that both time step and batch size are defined correctly. Now the user can modify the code to ensure that the output of tf.randomnormal is directly used as a tensor. Instead of wrapping it in tf.constant, the user can simply use the output of tf.randomnormal directly. Finally, the user should run the modified code to check if the type error is resolved. If everything is set up correctly, the code should execute without any errors. Fun fact, TensorFlow was originally developed by researchers and engineers from the Google Brain team for the purpose of conducting machine learning and deep neural networks research. Now, it's a go-to tool for developers worldwide. Now let's look at the answers provided by other users. This user points out that the issue arises because tf.constant requires a single value or a list of values, not another tensor. They explain that you cannot create a constant tensor using another tensor as its value. Here's a pro tip. Always check the documentation for the latest updates on functions and their usage. This can save you a lot of time and headaches in your coding journey. And there you have it. You should now have a clearer understanding of the type error you encountered and how to fix it. Remember, coding is a journey filled with learning opportunities. If you found this video helpful, hit that subscribe button for more tips and keep coding confidently.